Today is uh, a very special day for the National Fluid Power Centre and this is the fifth year that we've run the Industry Open Day. It's bringing the key representatives from the fluid power industry together and over the last uh, few years we've got involved with integrated systems engineering, electronics and control. So those companies are also now starting to attend which is absolutely great. We're able to show off our magnificent facilities. We've got over three and a half million pounds worth of equipment here now at the centre, all supplied by UK industry and all aligned to the education, training and skills development of the UK workforce. We've supported the NFPC right from the beginning. There's a lot of our product here. We enjoy working with the people. We've been part of the heritage of these open days. We've been to every single one, presented at most of them. Exhibiting is a really expensive game now. And of course, once you start investing, the expectations are the return. So I think the fact that it keeps it informal, and people will network, will talk, and it's nice and relaxed. NFPC is unique in what it does, and it does what it does very, very well, including today's event, uh, which is a great reason for, for being here, because it allows us to network, uh, to meet other users of the centre, and to also engage with some of our members who are actually in amongst the, the exhibitors and the delegates here today. When you come to an event like this, not only do you get ideas from other people, you meet customers, um, distributors, all people who are very much coming across problems and trying to solve them. And just networking, speaking to people, exchanging ideas is really important. And it helps us get an impression of what's going on and what the market needs and what people actually need um, to solve the problems that they're looking at. People come up with ideas that I couldn't have thought of in a thousand, in a thousand years. You know, think, oh, I've got this type of machine and I want to do this with it. Well, yes, well, that would have been perfect, but I've, I've never thought of that. You know, and so it's, it's the networking is essential. I've been out of the UK hydraulic scene for over 20 years, so I also saw it as an amazing opportunity to meet a lot of people in the hydraulics world. It's become the hydraulic show in the UK as I understand it. For me, it's a highly effective, seriously organised but informal in nature. From my point of view, it's been fantastic. All those advisory member companies, many who are exhibiting today, are active in developing and working with my staff to develop the training courses and the content so that they have a 100% effectiveness factor. They will not go anywhere else possibly in Europe and see the practical facilities that's here. And together with all my training engineers from UK industry, this is an absolute unique model of collaboration with UK industry.